My name is Onyeka Onwenu. My name is Onyeka Onwenu. My name is Onyeka Onwenu. The sad moment popular musician and actress Onyeka Onwenu slumped on stage while performing at the birthday of Dr. Stella Okoli. Hey, crazy things are happening. Crazy things are happening. Indeed, crazy things they happen. I concur to waiting terms talk because this is so 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 bad. Imagine the most influential Igbo woman. You heard me right too. The most influential Igbo woman slumped and died while performing at the most richest Igbo woman birthday. Hey God. 72 years Onyeka Onwenu, who is the most influential Igbo woman, died while performing at the birthday of 80 year old most richest woman. Hey, to God be the glory indeed. Yes, a very sad one. The most influential Igbo woman is dead. Onyeka Onwenu is dead. Most Gen Z Fino Sabi this woman I they talk about. She na politician, she na actress, she na musician, she na girl child advocate, and she na philanthropist. Only her five in one, yes. And she died performing at the birthday of the most richest Igbo woman. Hey, <laughs> all more things they happen. The most influential Igbo woman slumped and died while performing at the birthday of the most richest Igbo woman. Yes, 2024. And when they rushed her to Reddington Hospital, the doctors there confirmed her dead. But wait, so who is the most richest Igbo woman at the talk about? Where do her birthday on the 30th of July 2024? exclusive birthday as usual i'm talking about the founder and ceo of emzo pharmaceuticals i know say everybody go know emzo now one particular pharmacy where they popular for the country where we say any drug where you touch hand na emzo get them now she be the founder she founded emzo paracetamol or that is emzo pharmaceuticals when she was 30 years old she has been running this Ms of Mercedes for the past 50 years because she did 80 years old. And the woman, the most influential woman, will die as she did perform for this most richest woman birthday, died at the age of 72 performing. She slumped and died. If you know Sabiha, calm down, make I tell you one of the most trending songs about her, where fee come your head because Fino don't feature her and now this particular song she sing for that singer's song i'll be at the top my mouth <laughs> okay back to the matter you wanna know this song kaiga nanke bishop on a 12 corner um wambu na fone wanguri iyo koko iyo koko iyo koko apart from that one no he get another song way in oh mama in own mama will be hope on when her name na onyeka on when no but in own mama her name na hope on when you get one song where mama sing where she ma come copy and remiss we come talk to his song most of una will be gen z if you don't know i'm too bad una if you don't hear that chuku biko gozie oche dike mama now she get the song. He get plenty, plenty songs. She don't feature plenty, plenty people before she can turn into gospel artists. As I'm talking to you, this lady or this woman, most influential woman in Igbo land. Yes. Onye Kaonwenu, she died today. At the birthday of the most richest woman in Igbo land. Ah. Now she follow act if you know Sabi the song where she don't sing. Make I tell you movie where she don't act where they popular. You know half of a yellow song 
I'll be half of a yellow moon. Something like that. She follow for that movie. Yes, she follow. Another trending movie. Na Brave Heart. I'll be Lion Heart. Lion Heart, where Genevieve Naji um, produce. She follow for that movie. And latest thing where she don't do, you should be book lover. She the right book too. Her latest book where they just launched last year, where still there on launching today itself. My father's daughter, now she write up. So in all aspects of entertainment, she they among. And she be newscaster because she worked in NTA. We know National Television Authority NTA. She was pioneer of NTA. Hmm. This lady is most influential. I'm not capping. People will know how go call, call to this. Like Gen Z's go see this video, they go pass. But the millennials and the other generation, they go come down and watch them and they will give me a thumbs up for this. Even though say na sad news, at the same time, na still celebration of life because anybody we don't cross 70, we suppose celebrate them for this country. And also, she don't contribute to plenty things for the country. She don't pro like contribute positively to the country matter. Now, person where they speak out for the girl child matters. Anytime where you see anything girl child, now she follow for the advocate where they come out to come support the girl child movement because the girl child is very important in the society. If you don't know her, I beg, if you go to her page, you go check them out. But if you want to come here about her biography fully, about her songs, about everything, her net worth, go go to go about her, calm down. Go check out my YouTube channel at Lost TV Media on YouTube, where you go get the full detailed info about this late most influential Igbo woman, late Onyeka Onwenu. I come in peace, so no mind my mic holder. Peace out. Hey, wait, don't play that video yet. Welcome to Lost TV. This is your home of all daily Nigerian trending entertainment news and gossip you need to see and watch. Yes, we keep you entertained 247. Yes, 247. So just subscribe and press the bell icon to be notified anytime we drop the latest we do concerning your news and trending gist. So roll the video now. Roll it. Iconic singer and actor Onyeka Omwenu dies while performing in Lagos. Tragedy struck on Tuesday night as Nigeria's iconic singer and songwriter Onyeka Onwenu slumped and died shortly after performing at a birthday party in Lagos. In a shocking turn of events, the music maestro, affectionately known as the Elegant Stallion, according to sources, died at the Reddington Hospital in Lagos after collapsing at a private function. According to sources close to the family, Onwenu was attending a friend's birthday party where she took to the stage to perform. Immediately after her performance, she returned to her seat and suddenly slumped. Emergency services were quickly called and she was rushed to the hospital in Victoria Island, where she was later pronounced dead. The cause of death is yet to be confirmed. The source who spoke on the condition of anonymity said, It is very sad. Onyeka Onwenu just performed at the birthday of Mrs. Stella Okoli of Emzo Pharmaceuticals this night, and after performing, she slumped. She was taken to Reddington Hospital but couldn't make it. Onwenu, born on May 31st, 1952, was a multifaceted artist whose career spanned over four decades. She was not only a renowned singer and songwriter but also an actress, journalist, and politician. Onwenu's music, which blended genres including high life, reggae, and pop, often addressed social and political issues. Now, why he get one time with Felawa Maria? Some of her most popular songs include One Love, Iyo Koko, and Ekwe. Beyond her musical career, Onwenu was known for her political activism and involvement. She served as the chairperson of the Imo State Council for Arts and Culture. She was appointed executive director 
and Chief Executive Officer of the National Center for Women Development. In March this year, Onwenu had revealed that she was putting together a film that will focus on her experiences spanning several decades in the music industry. She had expressed her excitement to share her personal story of how Nigerian music has changed over time. She had also talked about plans to collaborate with up and coming musicians to release her iconic songs in a compilation of rebranded songs expected to be released later this year. It is not known yet if the future documentary or remix of her iconic songs had been concluded before her death. Now, so this life bio, the more you they plan for future events, the more you don't know whether it don't reach time for you to go meet your creator. Hey, come on. As with the plan, make with the prepare for anything will consign us. Now, why you go say, make we don't always live our life as if say, at the end because nobody know when the creator needs your attention for now that is it and i know say the movie industry go they really sad because na person will contribute majorly to the entertainment industry at large and everything because if you come for movie she be number one if you come for music she day journalism she day Political party, PDP, anything where you call them, she day into all field of entertainment. Or more, I call them wizard, I be witch of entertainment. Anyhow, for now, I go like hear your own story for the comment section where you got to talk about her death. But this is it. Thank you. Namaste. Bye bye. Thank you. I go by the name Black Mamba. Don't forget, I thank God for my subscribers, my phone, and my sub. If you like, if you comment, if you subscribe, I'll keep thanking God for you. I love you all.